So my hopes for postgraduate are that I managed to do it, <laughs> that I managed to finish it, that I was quite active as an undergrad, so I'd like to continue being quite active within the university and hopefully just steer myself in some sort of direction for the future. I enrolled on the course because I loved my research from my undergrad and I just wanted to carry on doing it really. No kind of career in mind, I just love the research, so that's why I'm here. Well, I think I found an advisor who I work really, really well with and um, we share similar passions, so I knew that he was going to support me and kind of push me when I need to be pushed. Um, there are so many opportunities to learn new skills, um, so I've actually started doing some public speaking and almost consultancy stuff, which is a bit scary. Um, but it's really good to develop those skills in my CV um, so that I'm a more attractive person to be employed. Um, I also get all the experiences of teaching in my school, um, which was terrifying initially, but actually it's really fun. And um, I enjoy having those relationships with the students and hopefully giving them some of that enthusiasm that I feel. So postgraduate, you are left to your own devices a lot more. Um, you have a lot less structure in your day, but I think that's okay because then you have to learn to be more independent, which as an undergrad you are taught those skills how to do, so that's just put to the test a lot more as a postgrad. And yeah, it just, it just feels a bit more grown up in a way. <laughs> Can't really explain why, but yeah, I think it's just because you've got to sort of juggle everything, like having a job still, and after this, who knows where you're going on to, so you've got to sort of prepare for that next step. Um, 